Right, I'm literally halfway through. Oh my god, the back of my hair doesn't seem like it's taking through the bleach. I'm halfway through bleaching my hair basically, so I thought I'd update the vlog. Because um, I've been saying in my vlog all night long that I was going to meet up with a friend and I actually may have been on a date. Wow, I'm starting my vlog in bed today. <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. Today is another filming day. Why is my hair always like this in the morning? Like, I don't know what I do in my sleep to wake up looking like an actual chicken. But I look like one of those chickens with the fluffy heads. Anyway, I've got another busy filming day today. I need to film two videos, so I'm gonna film an assumptions type video and also I'm gonna bleach my hair and I wanna film it because you guys seem to really enjoy that when I filmed that last time. So that's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna film the bleaching video first just because if that goes wrong or for whatever reason, I need to nip to Westfields and get a toner. I am actually going to Westfields later on because I need to drop off a parcel. I could potentially be meeting up with my friend later on as well. I'm not sure if that's going to happen yet though because I'm really, really busy. Also got to finish packing my suitcase. I've got a bunch of stuff to do. And right now, I'm laid in bed. I'm not laid in bed doing nothing though. I've edited up two videos. So I edited up my IGTV video that I filmed yesterday and also my vlog that's going up tonight. So that's the situation. Also, I just want to put it out there. I am vlogging like a day behind. I know some of you have been getting confused with what day it actually is. I've been vlogging a day behind so like so this vlog that you're watching now will have been filmed not the day before but two days before normally how vlogs work as you will know is you film the day post it the day after I'm always one vlog in front just because then it gives me a chance to edit the vlogs it also gives me a chance to make sure I've got another vlog ready for then because obviously if it's literally such a quick turnaround as of one day I'm so busy that I just know for a fact that it's just setting myself up for failure basically so I thought I would just make it easy for myself you guys are still getting daily content it's just two days behind instead of one. Also, this is an update on my lips, so ignore how dry they are because literally I've not been out of bed yet. The bruising's going a little bit. It's more going on this side. The bottom one were perfectly fine. I think it, the top is still swollen like here, like I can feel swelling. But apart from that, all is well, all is good. I also didn't wash my face last night before bed and I'm scared that I'm going to look up close in the mirror. Because in the camera it looks fine, but I just feel like my skin's going to be hurting me for that because I had bronzer on and I never washed it off. Love that. Today is really, really go, go, go. I'm eating my breakfast. And then I've got to get filming. So I don't really know what this vlog's going to be. Because I want to meet my friend later. So if I... But I need to get the two videos filmed before then. I also need to pack my case before then. And then I need to meet my friend. Which gives me like four or five hours to film two videos. One of them's bleaching my hair. Which is the one that I'm worried about. Because I'm going to do that first. But if it goes wrong or anything like that, then I've fucked up, you know? But we'll let him see. Who knows? So I could be using my mouth for. I'm gonna end this. Right, I'm literally halfway through. Oh my god, the back of my hair doesn't seem like it's taken through the bleach. I'm halfway through bleaching my hair basically, so I thought I'd update the vlog. This is currently what I'm doing with my life. Um, I'm really nervous that this is gonna fuck up. That's always fun. And also, I need to go to Westfields, I've just remembered, and I didn't, I didn't account for that. So I think I'm gonna have to film my other video when I come back from seeing my friend. I don't know how this is gonna go. I feel like I've really fucked up. I should have woke up so much earlier than I did, but I didn't know. Well, I did know. I'm dumb. This has got to sit for another half an hour, and I can hear it like crackling. I don't know if that's working, or if it's actually frying the living shit out of my hair, but it looks like it's turning blonde so we can help so everyone it is a long while later and i am now sat at the end of my bed just ignore the fact that my hair looks like this i really need to like re-bleach some of it and return some of it i'm gonna be wearing a beanie and i have been wearing a beanie all evening because um i've been saying in my vlog all night long that i was gonna meet up with a friend and i actually actually may have been on a date but i didn't want to say anything because i was like am i gonna put it on the internet am i not and then i tweeted about it so i was like all right i can tell my vlog this is as far as i'm gonna speak on the matter it went really really well thanks for asking and now i need to pack my case but <laughs> It was really unexpected. Anyway, I'm uh, gonna move on from that situation now. I just wanted to let you all know what I've been doing. You know, if this thing's gonna work, me daily vlogging and all. I need to be honest where I've been because I've not filmed much today because I've been on a date and that's why. Obviously, I'm not gonna film on said date. They were really, really nice. And that is all you need to know. However, I'm now gonna pack my suitcase because I had a little wardrobe malfunction. I didn't plan too much 
that I were going on this date, so I didn't really plan what to wear, which is why I'm wearing literally the jumper that I literally almost slept in last night. But that being said, I did have a little rummage through my nicely packed suitcase, so now I've got to repack this. I've just took all my whitewashing from out of the kitchen, and now I've got to pack my bags because I'm heading home tomorrow morning, which I also just realised I didn't mention this entire time, but yeah, I'm heading home tomorrow morning, so I need to figure out what I'm wearing to the train station. I've got an early-ish train, my train's at half past ten, which means I need to leave mine at like half nine, but yeah, then I'm going back home. I can't wait. This is really cringe, but I'm really, really happy. I think I'm like excited to go home and see my parents and my dogs, but then I'm also like just being on a date and it went really well and I'm not only bad at this stuff, so yeah. I'm gonna end the camera, this is awkward. What I can't be forgetting is... Oh, would you look at that? My feet sponge in the bathtub. Probably should remove that. What I can't be forgetting is my skincare, and we have a lengthy skincare routine, so... Oh, fuck, we do actually have a lengthy skincare routine. Right, I'm gonna have to put my camera down whilst I grab all my product. Right, I've never actually done, like, an actual skincare routine, but whilst I'm packing these into my suitcase, or should I say, whilst I'm packing them into this wash bag, I thought I would show you what I, um, use. So, I always make the mistake of forgetting to pack my skincare and then whilst I'm back home I break out so depending on how my skin feels or what I've done that day depends on what products I use so they're all from body shop though so I'm, I guess I'm just gonna show you what I alternate between these literally depending on the day depending on my mood depending on how my skin feels if I've had any products on my skin so if I'm breaking out or I feel that it's gonna be an actual spot I use these these are the body shop tea tree like this is a scrub so I use this first and then wash my face in this all with actually this Foreo I don't know which one it is this one gifted to me this weren't like a brand deal if they want to work with me hi I use it anyway literally the best thing ever I don't know if it actually does anything but it makes me feel like I'm doing a lot more than just washing with my hands so I use this with every single thing just bob a bit on do the brush 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 and also these as well these are the vitamin C body shop things so we've got the daily cleansing polish and then we also have the glow boosting micro abrasion micro abrasion thing I use this on a more just every day type of use because this is a daily glow cleansing polish so I just use this most days if my skin's feeling great or I'm not like feeling like I'm gonna break out or I've not had like a busy day where I've been greasy all day I just use this to generally wash my face with and then if I'm particularly not having a great time when it comes to blackheads I use this seaweed seaweed little moment I don't know what this actually is it's a pore cleansing exfoliator I just really feel like this gets I normally just use this on like across my this area I'm gonna say my t-zone but not my t-zone like this area I make chin sometimes as well actually so like my tin zone minus my forehead this is really really great as well so I'm gonna pack that in there and then for moisturizer I just use a Kiehl's one actually facial fuel really really good moisturizer just bob that on my face every time I showered and that's as far as my skincare routine actually extends I don't think I have, oh, my toothbrush, I need to pack that. I don't think I have anything else that needs to go in this bag, that being said. All the plex treatment for my hair, which I'm gonna do when I get back home. I think I'm all packed up. Now, this seems so excessive. However, my bag, my suitcase, should I say, is literally full because one side's covered with presents. So this entire bag here, one has a big box in it, and then it's just literally got a leather jacket and a pair of shoes in, which is excessive, obviously. I'm gonna be able to have that emptied and put into my suitcase. Like, everything's gonna fit in my suitcase on the way back down. However, right now, this is the current situation. So, big coat, my outfit that I'm traveling home in, my duffel bag, and then my shoes. I've got my bag ready there. Everything's sorted. I'm looking around my room feeling like I forgot something. Like, as long as I've got the Christmas presents, I realistically don't need anything else. I also do feel like I'm forgetting something that's really essential, and I can't think what it is. So, that's fun. I'm sorry I didn't film anything of that. I just realized that I've not actually filmed anything. I probably should have time-lapsed it. However, I'm literally so unbelievably tired. I've got to be up super early tomorrow, obviously, to have my breakfast and stuff I need to finish cleaning the kitchen make sure we take all the bins and stuff out I do apologize I just wanted to get it done as quickly as possible it's now like half past one in the morning I just wanted to make sure I got everything without the added pressure of oh is that a fun shot I think I'm all sorted I think I've got everything I mean even if I haven't it's not that big of a deal I'm literally back down in a couple of days anyway but yeah I think I'm ready to rock and roll like I said I'm so excited to see my mom and dad and my doggies and all my friends I'm just really excited I'm hoping my vlogmas doesn't go downhill because I've been so good at uploading every single day and I'm just just praying that just because I'm in Sheffield it doesn't like dip. That's the situation I need to go into the bathroom now and actually wash my face because I have a bit of bronzer on from the soup thing if you know what I mean. Gotta impress. My room looks so tidy damn. I was just about to end this clip but my room looks like clutter free for the first time in such a long time. You can really see in this light just how bad my hair dye is. Oh, oh my god look at that. Oh 
she missed. Thankfully, I wore a beanie tonight because that would not have been great. I need to go back home and I'm gonna get my mom to help me sort the rest of my hair out because that's bad. If you know any like platinum blonde type silver, like this color without the purpley part in it, like white hair dyes that are actually good, please do let me know. Your boy is in need. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm all ready for bed now. I'm so excited to go home tomorrow. Literally cannot wait to see my family. If you enjoyed this vlog, I don't think it was too long. Anyway, I love you all lots and I'll chat to you in the morning when I'm up bright and early, ready to go back home. I love you all. Bye!